dear friends. I'm glad you're here again today for the reading of Proverbs chapter 3. And we're going to read one verse a day and connect it with another verse in the Bible, preferably from the New Testament. And I'm, I'm doing this because I hope it will encourage you and I hope it will uh, show you how rich and powerful the Word of God is and that every scripture uh, is there to teach us something or to lift us up, build us up and encourage us. So today, verse 3. Uh, in my New Living Translation, it says, Never let loyalty and kindness leave you. Tie them around your neck as a reminder. Write them deep within your heart. There we have that heart again, as we saw in um, verse 1 and 2. We have to store up God's word in our hearts. And he is, it says, Never let loyalty and kindness leave you. Tie them around your neck as a reminder. And you um, write them deep within your heart. And I was reading that and I thought, okay, loyalty and kindness, kindness. I know I'm not always kind and people would probably not even describe me as a kind person. But here it says, never let loyalty and kindness leave you. It should always, always be with me. It should always come out of me. And um, it reminded me of a very uh, a ver a peculiar verse actually in the Gospel of Luke. Again, we'll go to Luke chapter 6 verse 35 and 36, where we can learn something about God's character, that he is actually a kind and loving and compassionate God. Uh, let me see, Luke 6, verse 35, well, you should read it in context, very interesting uh, chapter. Um, it says, love your enemies, do good to them, lend to them without expecting to be repaid, then your reward from heaven will be very great and you will truly be acting as children of the Most High. And then it comes, for he is kind to those who are unthankful and wicked. Hello. God is kind. God shows kindness to the ungrateful and wicked. How much more will he show kindness to us, his children, his sons and daughters? And if God is able to show kindness to the unthankful and the wicked, I mean, how much more should we be able to do so? Um, because that's the way his character will grow in us. And I think the writer of uh, uh, Proverbs understood that. That kindness is an, is, is, is an attitude or an, how do I say it, it's a character trait that we should all possess. And we should be recognized as Christians by our kindness, by our love. And that's what I want to leave uh, you with today, you know. Let loyalty and kindness never, ever leave you, no matter how hard it gets. So, hope to see you tomorrow. Bye.